Okay, continue for the notes. Uh, this one, fill in the blank, you go to fill in by yourself. Uh, okay, you can find from the textbook, that means you can get the answer. Uh, this one, formula, la, 1 AMU is how many? La, uh, 1 mega electron volt is how many? Uh, so you go to write. Uh, this one is an explanation for just now, graphite. I told you the graphite, what is that? Then the boron. A uh, boron, remember, there is lower. When they just put lower, they will absorb the neutron. Then the rate of fission can be reduced. Uh, so this is a one of the things you need to know. Can be reduced. Graphite is slower neutron. This one is absorb. Okay? This is totally go to absorb. Okay? So this is the differences between the graphite and also boron. Boron is more effective lah. Okay, so this one is how to generate a steam generator, water into the steam, turn the turbine, then the turbine get it, then generate electricity. This one is a part four and five. Lah. Okay, this one you fill in the blank. Okay, chain reaction is here. Okay, example one, two, three, we finish. Then you need to go is example four. Okay, we do example four together. Okay, example four, they give you all the info already. The masses. So, we also do the same thing. Calculate the energy release. So, from here, we just write PO. PO is 210.0988 uh, Then go to minus, lah, minus this all thing. 205.986511 plus 1 helium 4.002603. Okay. Then after you minus, I get it, there's a 0 0.109749 AMU. Uh, this one, what I get it. Lah. I don't know correct or not. You're going to check. Huh? Okay, after that, I want to convert, become mass defect. Okay, I go to multiply. Lah. Take the whole thing, go to multiply. Okay, bring here. Then you multiply 1.66 times 10 power negative 27. Okay, finally, I get it, there's a 1.8. Two, then one eight three three four. Okay, then the power is negative twenty eight kilograms. Then the last one E equal m c squared. Okay, one point six four times ten power negative eleven. Okay, so the next one I think this one is don't have any equation from your notes. Okay, this one you add in the example five because it never show about the equations. So this one is the equation for nuclear fusion. Eh? Okay, the question also same. They want to calculate the energy. So we're going to show how to calculate the energy. The calculation is the same. Eh? So from here, because you've got two uh, deuterium, so I just take 2 multiply 2.014102. 2. Okay, I need to minus the helium. 3.008914. Plus one neutron, six six three. Okay, so after that I get the answer. AMU is okay, zero point zero zero one zero two eh six two seven. Ah, okay, AMU. So how to check? Normally it's zero point zero something one. Right? Sure what? Right? Because you after minus are not big number one. Right? So after that we take this one zero point zero one zero six two seven. Go to multiply the kg negative 27 so answer 1.764082 times 10 power ne uh, negative 29 so this one is the calculations so after that we take this one chain become e equal mc square okay so we multiply 3 times 8 power square answer 1.59 power uh negative 12 okay so this one is the answer Okay, so many steps. Huh? So the question, uh, when you do a little bit mistake, okay, they never minus all. Huh? Maybe you do this one wrong already. The final answer wrong, huh? then they give you calculation marks. Okay, after that, you, this one you bring to do the calculation for E equal MC square, is it? Okay, M you sure wrong already, but the formulas correct, they still give you one mark one. Okay, because you carry error forward. Okay, they never give you zero because the calculation is correct. Formula is correct. Just you use the wrong answer put in. So they still give you one marks. So this one is how to go to marks the 
question lah. Okay, so this one is the 5 and also the 4. Okay, we go and see the tutorial. Okay, answer. Fast forward. Number 1, which one is a fusion? Boy. Okay, boy. Huh? Okay, number 2, this one is what? Fusion, fusion of uranium. Fusion of uranium. Okay, next. Number 3. It's a possible whole chain reaction to occur in the nuclear fusion because what chain reaction will happen? A. Yeah. A. Because the neutron. They're going to find another uranium. Okay, number four. Yeah, yeah. The hydrogen one fusion or fusion one? The hydrogen is a fusion one. Ma. Oh, okay. Okay, the nuclear reactor, which one can slow down? Slow down. Graphite. Graphite. Okay, boron is absorbed. This one is a reduced rate. And this one only slow down. Okay? So, number five. What energy convert to what energy? Sure, nuclear energy start. Boy. Lah. Boy, yeah. Final generate electricity. Okay, number six. Which one is not true? I'm going to check one by one. Not true. Okay, control road. Okay, control road means the rate of control, the rate of fusion. Cooler want to cool down. Lah. Okay, take away the heat. Graphite, slow down. Okay, concrete shell to prevent the radiation radiation from atmosphere entering the into the direct. You got any atmosphere want to go in? No. No, so D is wrong. Okay, seven. Which one is sufficient? Fission. Okay. Donkey. Ah, when you see uranium, sure. Okay, eight. Type of the reaction are nuclear heavier after the reaction than before. Are the nuclear heavier, heavier after reaction than the before? So answer after reaction, you are more heavier. Which one? Uh, D. D donkey because this one is a uh, light. After that, become heavier. Okay, this one's the balik. This one is a heavier, then become lighter. Okay. So number nine, which one following is not the similarity? For the fission and fusion, not similarity. Okay, both experience mass defect. Yes. Okay, both produce a large amount of energy. Yes. Both reaction produce new nuclei. Yes. Then the last one, both or nuclear reaction require very high temperature. Which one need require high temperature? Is it fusion? Or fusion. Ah, uh, only fusion. Fusion no need one. Okay, so this one is donkey. Okay, number 10, calculation. What is the energy release? Uh, they give you mass defect. Okay, calculation. 1.8 times 10 power of 14. A, okay. okay. Okay, 11. Again, what's the energy release? They give you AMU. Uh, convert the AMU, become kilogram first. So the answer is... Donkey, donkey. So we go structure. So this one is a fission, uh, uranium and also the neutron. Okay, the following give you the info for the masses. Okay, the first one, what is the value for the X? Okay, you want to check the X better, we're going to check the neutron number. Okay, 2, 3, 5 plus 1. Uh, this one is a before. Equal 141 plus 93 plus... Uh, X, one. Okay, X wrapper, two, three, five, plus one. Two. Two. So we got two neutron. Huh? Okay, what's the value for the X? The answer is two. Okay, so name the nuclear reaction involved. So this one is a nuclear vision. Okay, what is the meaning for new? Vision, 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 vision. Oh, yeah, yeah, vision. Vision, huh? what is the meaning for nuclear reaction? You mentioned just now. Nuclear fission. They ask you what's the meaning. Okay, the meaning is... Okay, anybody can tell me? Splitting the... Heavy uh, nuclear. Uh, when they when they bombarded by the... Uh, neutron. Uh, neutron. After they split, how many nuclei? Uh, into two or more lighter nuclei. Okay, after that, and also? Releasing a large amount of energy. Hey, wait, you've got three more what? Or oh, three more neutron. Uh, three more neutron. Balu, last one, release large amount of energy okay so you go and copy from the in front 
Okay, I do not hear. Okay, so you copy from the in front. What means of the nuclear fission? Okay, state what application nuclear reaction we using. Nuclear fission we using in power, a uh, nuclear power station. Okay, so calculate the energy release. Okay, so calculate. So you refer here lah. Calculate uranium go to plus the neutron. Then you minus CS minus RB. Don't forget you minus two neutron. Ah. Okay, now you do your calculation for the mass defect. Okay, there's a 235.04392 plus one neutron. 867. Okay, this one you plus first. Then you go to minus. Minus, we got 92.92157. Plus 140.91963. Plus, again, your two neutron. Okay, two neutron are two, 1.00867. Ah, this one is going to multiply. Ah. Okay, after that, you see you get how many AMU. So what's the answer for the MU? 0 0.19411. Oh, wait, uh. I don't know. I'm going to check first. Eh? Okay, the MU is 0 0.19405. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 405. Okay, AMU. Uh, so we just write AMU. Okay, then we convert to kilograms. Mass defect. Okay, that's a equal to the, I get it, that's a 3.22123 times 10 power negative 28 kilograms. Then E equal mc squared. Finally, I get 2.899 times 10 power of negative 11 joule. Yeah, correct. Okay, uh, so be careful. Uh, the student, you must practice how to press your calculator. Uh. This is one of the easy questions only. The important is the number quite long so in the breast correctly okay and also the step which one you want to do first which one later okay after this they will ask about the energy release then you need to go the power remember the power formula energy dy by the time remember the form the definition rate of uh, rate of means over the time so the power is over the time one ah uh. So that means you take just now the energy, you find the energy just now is how many? Uh, 2.899 times 10 power negative 11 over micro is how many? Eh? Micro power of? Uh, negative 6. Okay. So you get your calculator, get the answer. Answer power unit is what? Eh? What? So I get it 5.798 times 10 power of negative 6. Okay, don't forget the formula. Uh. Energy, the formula is a force multiply displacement. So power is a energy over the time. So remember the energy is a PT. La. Then we go to the last one, 13. Okay, 13, they show you about the equation, mass before and also after. Okay, so this has a nuclear fission. Okay, before they give you all the atomic mass this is after so better we're going to find the defect first lah because later they show we ask you what's the mass defect difference so we go to find out this one minus the final so i get it three point three zero by something okay zero point two zero two five two you okay so this one's about i get it so i need to go the next one Next one is the fusion. Okay, we also go to minus. So after minus, I get it. The answer is a 0 0.0197. Okay, so now we can see the comparison. Okay, which one produce more mass defect? This one. Fusion, a fission. They produce more mass defect. If this one more mass defect means the kg also increase law. If I convert to energy joule, they also increase, no? is it? So fission will produce more of the energy from here or oh, for this one situations. So this one fusions, they only produce 0 0.0197 mass defect. So that means when they convert to kg, they become less. 
When they convert, become Joe, they also become less. Okay, for this one situation. So we go to answer. Okay, what means by nuclear fission? Again, repeat what you write just now. Okay, the neutron bombarded with the heavy nucleus as splitting become two lighter nuclei. And also emit three neutrons and large amount of energy. Okay, nuclear fission. Okay, number two, compare nuclear fission and nuclear fusion. Okay, we compare what? You see the question. Later, they ask you relationship between the mass and energy. So we compare the mass and energy for the fission and fusion. Later, we do the relationship. So from here, just now I call you to do the calculation for the mass defect because the following question need to compare. So from here, we can find the mass for the fission is more than the fusion. For the energy, also same. The fission more than the fusion energy. So relationship, mass and energy support is a directly proportional. You also can write when the mass increase, then the energy also increase. Okay, later I show you the answer. Huh? We go to discuss first. Okay, and the last one is a nuclear fission produce chain reaction. Then they describe how the chain reaction will be happen. So chain reaction happen, you need to explain the first fission. And you explain the first fission first. The neutron bombarded with the heavy nucleus, and then you continue, they produce a three neutron. Then you say that three neutron will continue to do the nuclear fission. Okay, they will find another three neutron and bombarded again. Then you just say the process repeated. Okay, so we go and see the answer here. Okay, first one. The what mean of the nuclear fission? The splitting of the heavy nucleus into the two lighter nuclei. Okay, this one forget. You need to write neutron. Bombarded heavy nucleus and uh, baru split splitting into two lighter nuclei. Okay, which emit two or three neutrons. After that, release large amount of energy. So this one is a meaning for fission. Okay, then the B, we need to do the comparison. So we compare nuclear fission, bigger mass defect. Nuclear fission produce large energy. Last one, the bigger the mass defect, the larger the amount of the energy produced. So we do comparison, mass and also the energy. Last one, we do the relationship, mass and also the energy. Okay, and the last one is what means of chain reactions. Okay, chain reaction. Okay, so you must say the first round for the splitting for the uh, nuclear fission first. When a heavy nucleus is bombarded by the fast-moving neutron, it split into the two lighter nuclei, two or three neutron and also large amount of energy release. So this one is sufficient. Okay, you explain one round first, and then you continue. The three neutrons will continue to bombard it with another three heavy, unstable nucleus and produce a new neutron and the large amount of energy produced. Okay, then you just add the process, continue. Okay, so this one we call chain reactions. Okay, understand? Yes. Okay, just only the short topics for the... Chapter 6.